machine. Like I said, it was designed to optimize the polymer processing research cycle. Basically, what would happen before is that you would run an extruder, run your polymer through, get your polymer product, and measure the properties of that polymer film and see if it's what you want. And basically, you would have a lot of process parameters, and you'd have to vary each one. And obviously, these extruders probably take about five hours to run. It's not very efficient. So my advisor decided to design this machine with an automated feedback loop. There's three hoppers where we can add three different types of polymers and these are basically melted into a polymer melt with the melt tube here. These two extruders are joined in to the first mixing head and then meets up with the third polymer stream into the final mixing head which creates the multi-layer polymer films. These are extruded out of this die block here and whatever is extruded out gets put in between these nip rolls and eventually stretched. These modules measure the level of orientation of the polymer. This um, module measures the birefringence of the material. The film comes out from the first birefringence measure and goes into these Godet rolls. How fast it spins and the temperature of these rolls can be independently controlled. The more you stretch the polymer, the more oriented and stronger it becomes. And the more you heat it, it wants to relax and the weaker it becomes and less oriented. So by using the two, we can vary how much the polymer is oriented. After the polymer's been stretched, and heated and its orientation varied, we can measure it again with this second birefringence counter. And finally, it goes through a final stage of heating. If you bend down, you can kind of see these glass air nozzles, which yeah. is the air heating provided by this module. Eventually, the entire film's taken up through this pickup section right here. Then this sends data back to the main control panel, and it automatically adjusts these Godet rolls to increase stretching, increase heating, so you can have basically your quality control already incorporated into the actual machine. Mm -hmm.